Guys, just real quick before we get into today's video, I just wanted to tell you that I now have a Clips channel. I post all of the big packs over there, as well as looking at new players, showdown upgrades, and reacting to the first look at SPCs. Make sure you go over there and subscribe. It's Vipalization Clips if you want to see more from me. Kyra is the newest SPC in FIFA 23. Of course, out of position is back, which is quite nice to see. But overall, I think this card is a little bit overpriced. 85 rated squad and an 82 rated squad. As you can see on your screen right now, he has got the five star skills. A three-star weak foot, though, which is a little bit poor, in my opinion. 93 for pace, 90 dribbling, 84 shooting, 80 passing, and 74 physical. His traits are just a flair and speed dribbler. He can also play a whole host of alternate positions, to be fair, Tim. Striker is what we've got him at. Comes out as a left wing. He can also play left mid and right wing, which is quite nice. And, you know, a card like this is quite hard to link. Bundesliga teams aren't the best on this game. And he is Ghanaian. So if you've got SCN, for example, or... Boating his winter wild card, which I don't think is a very good card. You can link him, but other than that, you do have to essentially go for at least six or seven Bundesliga players, as I have, to get him onto chemistry. And his in games are pretty cool. Um, he's got 97 acceleration and 90 sprint speed. Good finishing, okay shot power, and good attack position in there at 86. Long shots and volleys are quite bang average at 80. Passing is very bang average as well, other than his vision and short pass being relatively decent. Dribbling is nice for the most part. 97 agility and 95 balance is really nice. Reactions a little bit lower, 83. Ball control good at 88 and dribbling good at 90. And then 80 composure is a little bit low once again. 97 for jumping, 89 for head and accuracy, and 90 stamina is nice as well with 70 strength. Chemistry starts for him. I think you've got a few options. You can maybe go for a Hawk if you want to play him at Striker. I think Hawk would be really good. A Maestro at Cam also be really nice to boost up the reactions also. I think it would be quite nice for him. And that's what I'm probably going to go for. Could also go for a dead eye or a finisher. Finisher's going to kind of be wasted though because his agility and balance is already maxed out almost already. But the reason that I like the Maestro for this card, guys, as you can see here, plus eight to the reaction. So up to 91 reactions now, which I personally think is a great boost. He's then got 98 dribbling also, and a decent boost to the passing as well, as you can see with 90 vision and 80, oh sorry, 91 short pass and 83 long pass. Good boost to the shot power, which is really important on this game just generally. Up to 91 and then 88 long shots with 84 volleys, guys. It's a cool card. As I said, a little bit expensive in my opinion. We're going to play a few games with him at Cam, a few games with him at Striker in Fight Champs Playoffs. I'm going to see how he goes. Let's get into it. For cheap FIFA 23 coins, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com to get fast and reliable coins. And make sure you use code VIPER at checkout. Get yourself a 5% discount. All right, then, lads. First game with this Kyra. Is that how you say his name? Kira? I'm not too sure. <clears throat> Excuse me there as well. Yeah, let's see how he gets on. I think it's Kyra. Kyra? Yeah, that's how you say his name. 100%. I've nailed that first time of asking. Here he goes straight away. So he got it feels really nice on the dribbling. Oh yeah. Hold on. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, his dribbling does feel good. Go on in. Ah. Whoa! <laughs> what an absolutely woeful start to this game that is. This man's got big Eric Cantona, which is nice. Wish I had big Eric Cantona in my team. But a nice start. Kyra was heavily involved there, to be fair to him. Oh yikes. I thought I had them step overs for sure. Save that, please. My red player pick, uh, Kobol. Nice. Good save there. Let's get this ball moving again. Uh, okay, Javi Alonso. Don't know what's happened to that card either, by the way, guys. He was really, really good when he first came out. But um, certainly nowhere near as good anymore. But we are in control of this game. This guy's not a bad player either for the uh, first game on new gen. So we've got to keep our... <clears throat> keep our... Toes up. I don't know if that's a saying or not. Nice from Kyra defensively there. Let's move the ball with him. Nice. Into Davies there. No, no, no. I've cancelled that. Definitely going to make sure the face cam's uh, lower for this one. So you guys can see that. I did cancel that. And I'm not joking. Oh, my God. He deserves a goal, to be fair to him. He deserves a goal. I can't get out for some reason. He's got a big Eric there as well. He's surely whipping that one. Nice from Kyra defensively again there. We're going to whip, play it straight back into him, though. Doesn't feel slow. He feels he actually feels lengthy. Go on then. Yeah, nice. Oh, what's that? We got away with it. We're passing to Salio there too. What on earth is that? Oh my god, Sabios. Nice. Pyro again. Oh, he feels really nice in terms of dribbling, but is is that gonna make him worth it? I doubt it. Okay, we've got a penalty there as well. I don't know how we've got that penalty. 
off Stevens Yellard there, but here goes. Uh, we'll take it. Oh, it doesn't look like he has very good penalties. He's got 61 penalties. Well, this is going to be a stinker, isn't it? That's actually not a bad penalty, to be fair. We're 2 0 up. Very nice there from Kyra. And yeah, as, as I said, guys, you know, th th this is a good card. Three star weak foot in March, though, is a little bit ish. You know, I, I don't really understand why we're getting three star weak foots now. Um, I feel like it should be better than that. Oh my god, man. And he, he's, he's one of them cards that feels a bit sideways, doesn't he? But in the same regard, you can't really fault it too much. You know, as I said, I feel like he's a bit expensive, but it's only because of the fact that we've got the hero pick right now. Our fodder's quite inflated. It's making it quite expensive. So I guess it's not all doom and gloom with this card, <clears throat> to be honest. And I think we're going to go to highlights soon, maybe after this break here. You can see that he feels fast, though. Like, he feels fast, fast. Wow. Let's try finesse with him. Okay, he's got a bad finesse shot. He's got a bad finesse shot. Or maybe that was on me a little bit. Uh, I feel like this card would be a lot better if they just improved his strength to like 80, 85. Uh, you know, and then I think you've got like a the, the knockings of a really good card there. Not to say he's bad because he's been good so far. I'm actually really excited to try him on old gem because obviously you can feel the dribbling a little bit better over there. But after this corner, we'll go to some highlights, I think. Nice little pass there into Bino Gittins from Kera. It's back into the beast. It's lovely. Lovely, it's a great finish too, and it's 3-0, guys. Very, very confident there from this card. All right, guys, moving over to old gen now. We've managed to play two games with him on new gen. And, you know, he's okay. I mean, he's nothing spectacular. He's, he's an okay card that just seems a bit sideways at the minute. And I, I'm interested to see what he's like over here because I feel like... With that high dribble in, he's going to have like an insane sprint boost and all that kind of stuff. Oh my god. An interesting start. He's managed to draw a foul there already, which is nice. And let's get the ball. Oh dear. That was just into Xavi Alonso. Uh oh. Get to that. No, I thought he was going to do a ball roll. I can't like. Oh, cheers. Is this what we're doing? Yeah. Is this how FIFA plays nowadays? Nice from Davies, though. Get that into Bino Gittins. Nice. See what Kyra's run's like here. We might have to play it into him early doors. Not with a pass like that, we won't. That's an upgraded Bino Gittins as well. That's crazy, isn't it? That is crazy. Nice from Davies, though. Of course, if you're a skiller, I think this card becomes like valuable anyway. Regardless of if you have a Bundesliga team or not. Always a nice card to have. Good finish from this lad. Good finish from this lad. And he's going to sell it as well. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I think it's one of them cards that... If you like to do skills, I think he's worth having, regardless of the fact that if you have a Bundesliga team or not. Because um, he does feel really sharp in terms of skill moves. Oh, unlucky there. That was unlucky. This guy's got Team of Virgil, like myself. Oh, this guy, man. <laughs> oh, mad that you can play like this. Please keep that in. No, not going to get kept in. Bad start on Nugen from me, not from uh, Kyra. But yeah, it, it just feels like another one of them sideways cards is what I'm trying to say. But man, his dribbling is good though. We are in with him actually here. Oh, Paul rolls the keeper but forgets the ball. Okay. Yikes. This guy plays so jarring. Uh. <laughs> okay. Got to wake up here. I can't lose to this dude. Poor from Kyra again there in my opinion. Um, I think that's just the game though, really. Stay side. Thank you. Yeah, weak foot. Oh, the freestyle oh, weak foot is going to ruin this card. Oh, okay. There we go. We've got a free goal off of it. Thank God. If you had a full side weak foot, we're already, you know, don't need that cheese there to get the equaliser. But, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll take it. We did deserve to score there anyway. Nice. Good football again here. Into Kyra again. So hard when you've got that team of the Virgil at the back. Oh, trust me, I know what it's like. Go on there, Miller Town. Nice, 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 nice. Right, let's drive into this space here. Nice, good football. It is nice football, this. Oh, no! Oh, it's the weak foot again, though. Oh, he managed to do the ball roll this time, and it's 2 1. And he's actually not bad. He's got really sticky dribbling. And that goes for. New and old gen. Uh, his, his dribbling is definitely his best asset, as we kind of expected. 
I, mean, I think the Maestro is going to be really, really crucial to enjoying this card. Really crucial. I mean, again, here. Go on, then. No! He moved the keeper and it threw me off a little bit. I thought we could have uh, still got round him, though. Unlucky there. Unlucky. Yes, this card's playing playing good, man. He, he's okay. He is okay. Not spectacular, but that left stick dribble in there, as you can see. Look at this. It's just the weak foot, man. The weak foot is literally the thing that's ruining this card, in my opinion. Because he is good, man. He is good. Here we go again. Good chance for him again here. Oh, my days. Yeah, see, look, you just can't trust him because of the weak foot. Ah, uh, it's disappointing, man. It's the only thing that I have to say bad about him so far. Is that weak foot. Really, really does hamper him. Look at how good his dribbling is, though, man. Oh, unlucky again there, man. Probably done too much of it again there, guys. Let's go to highlights from here. Oh, wow, he's got to score that. He's got to score that with 90 finishing. That's that's really frustrating. Oh, oh no, it's the weak foot every time. Yeah, man, his dribbling's good. Oh my God, what a goal. Oh, he's got to score that. 90 finishing is a lie. Oh, man, his dribbling is so good. His dribbling is so good. All right, guys. So, this Kyra is very, very interesting. Um, if you saw the last clip, I did say if he had a four-star weak foot, I think he'd be one of the best cards in the game. That is not true. That is not true. That's me getting a bit too excited. If he did have a four-star weak foot, though, he would be considerably better. He's not bad, though. He's a bit inflated right now because of the hero player pick SPC. And once he comes down just a little bit more, maybe to like 100, maybe 90k, I recommend this card. I think he's better on old gen than he is on new gen. Offers a little bit on both, though, because he's got such sticky dribbling. Uh, you know, he, he hasn't got the best ball control, but you can't really feel that in game. His skill moves are really sharp. And, you know, he, he, he turns so quickly with great R1 dribbling. His pass is pretty hit and miss. His shooting is pretty hit and miss as well. Even though he's got 90 finishing, didn't feel like that in game, especially when we were green time and stuff. Did not feel as good on the uh, shooting generally. He was really, really fast though. Doesn't have any strength, so he's very much a, a dribbler with good pace. And that is about it for him. His skill moves, as I said, feel really, really nice. The free star weak foot does really hamper him though, because you know it's, it's all well and good being able to do skill moves. You can't really... When you're in the moment, at least for me anyway, when I'm in the moment and I'm doing skill moves, I don't think about which foot I'm going to hit it on. I just think about the skill move that I'm doing. And then if I beat the last defender, I'm going to take the shot regardless of what foot it's on. And that's the issue with him because you end up taking quite a lot of shots on his left foot. And his left foot is uh, really, really poor. Had no issues with his uh, work rates either. Didn't really try too much of him in the air. We played him as almost like a second striker uh, with Mane and he was really good at that job. And yeah, I think he's a good card for a decent price, guys. As I said, once the player pick goes away, this card will be worth completed, in my opinion. Yes, he's hard to link. If you've got a Bundesliga side, stick him into that, no problem. If you don't have a Bundesliga side, I think this makes a really good super sub, in my opinion, guys. I'm going to rate him a value, probably a 7 out of 10. And then the quality of the card, I'm going to go for an 8 out of 10 on new gen. And then on old gen, I'm going to go for an 8.5 out of 10, in my opinion, guys. Let me know if you're going to complete it. Let me know what you think of this SPC as well. But guys, if you did enjoy, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell so you never miss a player review. But guys, that's going to be it for me for now. So take care.